Hello guys, this is our tutorials and I have a Sony Vegas tutorial for you today. Um, today I'm going to be showing you guys how to do a wave transition in Sony Vegas and here if I uh, open up this project file here I've already made it so if I play um, as you can see the text starts uh, transitioning or not transitioning but disappearing uh, kind of with a linear uh, gradient uh, wipe so and also it follows with uh, this wave so yeah it kinda disappears so that's a pretty cool transition um, by the way check out uh, Intrepid Labs he's an awesome channel he's our new partner for me and Xbox Fusion check out Xbox Fusion also um, the links to their channels will be in the description of this uh, video so please check them out if you like them subscribe so yeah let's move on with this tutorial let's go to file new in Sony Vegas uh, whatever um, and let's drag in a video it doesn't matter which video it could be an intro a video anything in this case I'll drag in this uh, optical flare as a video okay um, now let's right click on this uh, window right here click on insert video track and go to media generators and go to uh, uh, let's see linear black to transparent or first go to uh, color gradient and then go to linear black to transparent gradient and it's gonna open up this window right here if you drag it right there it opens up this window and uh, grab this first uh, first dot or circle whatever grab it and drag it in the middle it's a little bit laggy um, but if we grab the second one uh, we sh we drag it into the middle also close to the first one and keeping the line um, keeping the line vertical and let's click on this uh, plus button which is gonna add another dot and drag it to the other side of this uh, of this line so that it kinda gradually uh, fades out from both sides okay now let's go to the um, the compositing settings for this line so click on this green button right here go to custom select Sony height map click add and click OK and uh, if we go right here in that point in time in the video as you can see nothing is happening so if we just close out of this window and we click on generated media which is another green icon right here on the side of this line of this gradient line and we should change the color to uh, it actually depends on which color you choose that's how it's gonna look so let's see which ones is better Uh, let's see I'll put it to kind of in the middle closer to the top but it's up to you so once you have changed the color go uh, close out of this window and uh, now we can uh, animate this line this wipe and to do that uh, click on event pan crop on the side of the um, of this line click on it and uh, drag the uh, drag the line to the to the right and it's gonna go the opposite way it's gonna go to the left in the video and drag it until it disappears okay and um, yeah that should be on frame zero but if you didn't do it on frame zero then just take this 
keyframe right here and drag it all the way back to frame 0 so now it's by default or actually no it didn't work sorry about that it didn't work or no it did work but we have two keyframes right here so if we just uh, grab it and drag it back again no it goes back to uh, that's strange I'm just gonna go back uh, sorry about that I'm gonna skip back so that until we don't have this keyframe here anymore yeah just delete the keyframe uh, let's try this again go to frame 0 right here click on the keyframe at frame 0 and uh, drag this line to the side to the left side and uh, go to f uh, go to one and a half seconds and add a keyframe and drag this line towards the uh, towards the left side on here which is gonna be right side on the video so now you see this line going through the screen kind of a wave so now we can exit out of this window now we're gonna have to create a text and uh, to do that first we're gonna have to create a new video track so right click on this video track and click on insert video track and right click on this window here uh, click on insert text media and change the text to whatever you like I'll just keep it at sample text okay uh, now drag the text back to the beginning and uh, increase the length of it to about here so it kinda passes the length of this video which is the line which is the wave okay um, so now uh, we want to make the transition of the text but before we do that we have to drag the layer the text layer downwards below the line layer okay so that the text gets um, distorted also so that's pretty cool um, yeah so now we can start uh, animating the uh, the text transition also so to do that go to transitions tab and go to linear wipe tab and uh, select left to right hard edge and drag it uh, drag it down to the sample text to the end of the sample text actually and um, right here in this window that pops up increase the feather to about 0 0.4 and uh, exit out of that and now what you have is a linear wipe transition but we have to sync it with this transition which is the wave transition with this wave line in the middle we have to sync it with that and to do that uh, just drag the linear wipe um, transition back so that it starts transitioning as soon as this starts transitioning okay so drag it back to the to where the line starts transitioning if you understand what I'm talking about okay uh, now uh, we're gonna do some minor adjustments but before that we'll hit play and see how it's actually transitioning so as you can see it takes a little bit too long to transition for the text so uh, drag the text video back a little bit make it a little bit shorter so that it stops transitioning at the time when this wave stops transitioning alright um, and now we, if we hit play now we can see that the text starts transitioning too soon so let's drag the uh, the linear wipe transition on the text um, so that it matches the starting of the uh, of the wave transition 
and if we hit play you can see that it transitions perfectly so that's about it for this tutorial thank you guys for watching i hope you guys enjoyed the video and please uh, hit the like button please subscribe if you like the video or if you like my content and see you guys later